tell them what we're gonna make. We're gonna make brownies today. We're gonna make warm, uh, 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 not yet, what warm that? caramel brownies. Mm -hmm. Yum. Eat. It's All right, mommy's gonna share this to her page real quick. No <laughs> touch yet. Not yet. personal page Ow, what's the and I'm gonna pull it up and have the comments a little bit closer oh, hold on. no not yet get your fingers out of the water let me turn the volume down on this okay this way I can see if when any oh. comments pop up Let's do this. Maybe over here? No, I can't see it. A little sign. Okay. Let me move this back to the camera for a second. card Kenzie stop we need our recipe card all right so we've got the oven preheating okay so next we're gonna add this this is our brownie mix we already cut the bag open no you're not putting your hands in you're just gonna pour pour <laughs> Whoopsies. Yeah. Taste the chocolate. Right, as you're hopping on, say hi. I didn't really mean taste the chocolate goober, but as you're hopping on, say hi and let us know you're watching. Let us know where you're watching from. Um, let us know. Are you a edge like the brownie oh stop God. it doesn't need mixing yet okay now we need to add hold on okay so do you like the edges or are you a center brownie person this. in a minute okay mix the brownie mix water so gently pour this water in gently don't drop the bowl okay I'm done with that one the oil gently Ooh. and then the eggs gently there we go okay a lot of oil eggs and a quarter cup of brown sugar okay so what you're gonna do with this one is you're gonna push here mommy's gonna hold here you push this push 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 all right yes. we got it yeah. all right we're gonna move these out of the way real quick and mommy's gonna rinse can her I hand put can I put paper towel i guess Ugh. no not yet we gotta gently fold those in after we're done mixing this up can i mix them i'll be careful all right so who we got watching with us tonight What's in the world I don't know what got on this. All right. No, We're going to use our stainless steel whisk. Can I do it myself? I'll be careful. Just making sure. She was playing with this, so I'm trying to make sure that. Okay. Can I get it started real quick? Let me 
can get some of this stuff down in here. Like this. Oh, oh Mom. I think you're smushing it. I am kind of smushing it. And then I'm going to kind of scrape the bottom. But me, I want to go on myself. Okay, here. Give it some mixes. I'm going to hold the bowl. Use both hands. There you go. All righty. So, what we've got going on in the background, oh my, is, I think there's too much liquid in it. Mm -hmm. um, making our dinner, we're having some open faced tuna melts. Okay, can mommy give it a try real quick? our dinner uh, hubby yum. working on the dinner in the background not yet not yet please please don't stress mommy out all right hold on i'm trying to scrape the sides really good Spatula. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Be patient. Gently, we're gonna just kind of mix these in. Can I do it myself? Okay. Here, how about you help me? Okay. We're gonna gently fold them in. So we're kind of folding the spoon Whoa. and the batter over Ouch. Ow. and over again. Here, well, let me scrape. You don't want to help with brownies, but this is making with Mackenzie. Mom, you help without making with Mackenzie. You want to help what? But she wants to help with that making with Mackenzie. Oh. All right, so now we're almost done with this. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get this bar pan. Our big bar pan. And we're going to carefully, should we spritz it with oil just to be safe? Yeah, I can do that. Okay. okay. We're going to slide everything like that. Um, Beth, I know we've been married for a while, but uh, just mayo, right? Wait. Yeah. Okay. We're about to get oil all over. All right, so this is the kitchen spritzer. It's really cool. So instead of having your canned aerosol uh, 
kitchen oils, you just put regular old olive oil or vegetable oil <laughs> into this kitchen spritzer and then you pump it to give it a pressure. Will you stop? And then it sprays like an aerosol. Boy. All right, now we're going to pour it into the pan. Soil. Soil? Like thing. Okay, honey, honey, can you? <laughs> Demacil silicone. Thank you. Anti-foaming agent. Mommy has short arms, so it's really hard. Yeah, so there's none of those other chem... Uh, get your fingers out, baby. There's none of those other chemicals that are going to be found in your spray Aerosol. oils, aerosols. So it just it makes it a little bit of a... Uh, makes it a healthier process. <laughs> Say hi to Mr. Greg. Mr. Greg is watching. Hi, Mr. Greg. Hello? Oh, here we go. Is that a lick? After I'm done spreading everything, we can give it a look. Okay. Look at mommy being nice, huh? Can I give it a lick now? Gotta spread it all. Look, does that look like it's spread out? Hey, babe. Yo. Can you do me a favor? Maybe. Can you come take this classic batter bowl from me? Sure. <laughs> Can I give you a lick? Don't tell me what you done. All right, so now we're going to kind of spread this evenly throughout here. You were done with it, right? Yes. So it called for making cake-like brownies, so we added an extra egg above what you would for a normal brownie mix. Whoa. For the fudge brown? Yeah, we're using a, just a fudge brownie mix with added morsels. Were those not supposed to go in? No, they are. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hey, 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 Minnie is getting in the... Oh, my! All right. <laughs> now we're going to pop this in the oven for about 20... And I don't think we're going to stay live for this unless we want to just show them what we're doing with the dinner. Uh, it's up to you. Do you want to be a short one or? Even no, take this. Lick it. We can pop it in the oven and then have Kenzie help do the thing over here because it worked really well. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh. Ovens are hot. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna. I'm gonna set my timer for 10 minutes because halfway through I'm gonna have to flip it. Because if you've watched my lives before, you know that my oven does not cook evenly. Hey, Blanca, what's up, girl? Are you back in Arkansas yet? What's that look? Looking off. I'm getting dirty. Yeah, sure. Okay. Do you want to divvy it up real quick, or are these mine and Adrian's? Yes. Okay. All right, so we're making, like I said, open-faced tuna melts. Y'all done? Do not want chocolate in my open-faced tuna melt. Okay. So we've got some tuna. We're going to do this in the air fryer. So super excited about that because I love using the air fryer. I love having it because, like, if we're doing something in the oven, you know, like we're cooking dessert in the oven right now. So... Yummy, yummy. It means yummy, we can cook our dinner yummy, yummy. at the same time as we're cooking our dessert instead of having to like wait things out and everything. And so it's just simple, like however you want to make your tuna. You put it on, like I just do mayonnaise because I'm a picky eater. Hubby here does mayonnaise and relish. Okay, all the way, stop, all the you way down. You gotta do it all the way down, baby. Just one, stop. Okay. All the way down, and then let it Look. go all the way back up. I don't know if the warranty one. covers overly excited toddlers. So yeah, Hubby puts relish in his tuna. I'm not a huge fan of that. Um, so, Yummy. we make two separate batches. We use, what size cans are these? The big cans? Yeah. Uh, what are these? Yeah. 
12 ounce? We use the 12 ounce Wet. can. We do uh, one can per person. So one can per hamburger bun set on the jumbo buns. Yummy. So tried the salad spinner, salad and berry spinner to, to drain the tuna. So that's how we lose a lot of tuna. Mm -mm. No more than you would like using the can or okay. another strainer. So we have a, a can strainer, but it's for your normal sized like vegetable cans or the smaller tuna cans. And the nifty can opener we have leaves a lip right there on the lid, but it's nice and smooth. Okay. Like I just rub my finger on it and nothing. Same thing here. So well worth having, you know, especially with the toddler in the house or even if you've got pets that like to get into the trash. Or, you know, clumsy kids or, yeah. Clumsy teenagers learning how to, you know, fend for themselves or whatever. Right, so... so I decided to try the salad spinner, salad and berry spinner, to drain our tuna. And... Is getting two sets of cheese too, or? I don't think so. Okay. And, and as you can see, it took care of a good bit of the water with very little tuna being flung off to the sides. So, to I'm actually kind of impressed it worked out that way. I'm glad it did. But... Now, like say, I'm not able to use the uh, can lid to drain the water like we used to with this one. Okay, hey, bring the volume down. Alright, so. Realize that is all sorts of delicious. Yep. Oh. I don't think the apron helped keep your shirt safe. I don't think it did, kid. So, what do you think? Do you like the brownie mix? Uh huh. Show everyone your face. You got a good chocolate face going. <laughs> in his and um or he puts relish in his tuna there we go wow um we're running out of we're running out of things to do so we might go ahead and cut this and then come back live here in a little bit when we put the finishing touches on the brownies yeah we can do that all right so we're gonna go ahead and cut this and we'll come back live here in about 15 ish minutes or so and we'll put the no, finishing touches no. on the brownies. I'm going to move these away from the chocolate monster. What? I really don't want chocolate in my tuna. <laughs> so, all right, Kenzie, can you tell your viewers goodbye? And tell them we'll see them in about 20 minutes. See you in 20 minutes. <laughs> all right. Thanks for watching, y'all, and we will be back here in just a few minutes. Y'all have a good one.